Oh man, look at this. It melted the CDs together. Oh my god, I've never seen that. Oh, look at that. It like, it bubbled up. Look at the bubble it made. What's going on guys and welcome back to the channel. So we kind of have an exciting but different video today for you guys. So what we're going to do is we have the microwave. Da, 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 da. And then next to the microwave, let me turn the camera, we have shit that we're going to put in the microwave. Yay! So what we're going to put in the microwave is we got four different things. We have regular style, old school light bulbs, like the ones with the filament in them, the ones that your boy created back in the 1800s. Same technology. We got one of these. No LED bulbs. This is just a regular filament bulb. We got two of those, all right? We're gonna put that in the microwave. And then we got a bigger one. This is a floodlight. Same thing, it has a filament in it. We're gonna put this in the microwave, okay? We got CDs, old CDs that we're gonna throw in there. And then our finale, we're gonna put a motherboard in the microwave. So y'all don't wanna miss it. Make sure to hit that like, subscribe if you're new, leave a comment below. And then for safety, we have this old fire extinguisher, but it's still reading good. I don't wanna use my good fire extinguisher that's on the wall. I'd rather use the old one, but let's see if this works. So let's do this. Okay, so up first is the light bulb. Tell me below in the comments what you think will happen when we put the light bulb in the microwave. I kind of know what's going to happen, but I want to see what happens. So, let's do this. We'll put it on. Wait a minute, is it not plugged in? It ain't plugged in, bro. Oh, now we're ready. Okay, y'all ready? God, it's making everything flicker in here. What? That is so awesome. Oh my God, that is so cool. Oh my God, that is so awesome. Look at it glow. That is too cool. All right, we'll stop that. Wow. That was pretty cool, right guys? Yeah. That was cool. All right, let's uh let's see what happens when you put the other light bulb in it. I don't want to touch it. Oh. Jesus. Oh yeah. It is super hot. Oh my god, it's smoking. It's like smoking. Jeez, I wonder, God, I can feel it through this heat blanket. It's so cool. Okay, 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 okay. Wait a minute. I know I said we're going to do the light bulb, but let's do, let's try out the CDs. I want to see what happens when you put CDs in the microwave. So here's a CD. There's a CD. Close the door. Do it for 10 seconds. No, a minute. That's a minute. Okay, a minute. That works. Okay, are y'all ready? Here we go. Boom. Oh. Oh, that is awesome. Oh my God, the lights flicker. Why is it, why is the lights flickering? I don't know why the lights flickering. It's pulling a lot of juice though, it must be. Oh, that is too cool looking. Wow, you think your uh, think your pornos are still good after this? <laughs> wow, that is too cool. 
Oh my god, it stinks. It smells like burnt plastic in here. <laughs> that is too cool. Oh man, that stinks. Hey, your dinner's done. <laughs> Woo! Oh Jesus, that smells. Oh, that stinks. Jesus. Bonus content. <laughs> Thank you. Subscribe. Oh man, look at this. It melted the CDs together. Oh my god, I've never seen that. Oh, look at that. It like, it bubbled up. Look at the bubble it made. Look, it made a bubble, like a perfect cylindrical bubble. That is too cool. And it like, it warped the CDs. Man, it looks like somebody shot them with buckshot. Yeah, no, this, this right here says the secret. So I think the secret's safe. I don't think you could pull any information off, but the data to a CD is right here in that ring. Nope. That's crazy. Wow. Melted it like it was nothing. All right. Well, let's move on. Let's put a light bulb, a bigger light bulb, and a CD in it at the same damn time. And let's see what will happen if we put them like that. Together. Boom. Seems that element gets hot in there. Wow. I don't understand why it's shutting the lights off. I don't know either, but it does. Oh, wow. That is too cool looking. Oh, no. Woo, it's popping. Jennifer wouldn't let me use the microwave in the house, so I had to use this microwave. Remember when I used to heat the tires? Yeah, I used to put go-kart tires in the yeah, oven and heat them. Fun. Yeah, I remember that. And then we'd put them in the freezer, or we'd put ball bearings and stuff in the freezer to shrink them. Oh, man, that is too cool. I love how it's glowing like that. It's done! Hope right you like here, it well right cooked. Oh man, it, it killed the lights and everything. What? Uh-oh. I have no lights. Did I blow a fuse or a breaker? Probably. Because my light's not working now. Oh yeah, nothing's working now. But the, the microwave is, is on. I... Looks like it's been hit by a bolt of lightning or something. It's all bent and whacked out of frame. I don't know if you guys can see it very well. Wow, that's actually pretty cool. Now let's take a look at the CD. Let's open the see the CD. Oh yeah. Oh wow, it's all crap. CD is. I mean, it is. Wow. It's crazy because those cracks, it's still smooth. Like, it's smooth on both sides of the CD. So those cracks are like on the inside of the CD. That's really cool. It almost looks like art or something. You know? I like that. That's, that's awesome. Make sure to leave me a like on this video too if you guys like it. Because I think it's cool. All right. So we've put in a light bulb in there. We've put in CDs in there. The next thing to put in there would be the motherboard. And I will be honest with you guys. I am kind of nervous about doing this. I'm not exactly sure what's going to happen when I put a motherboard in a microwave. What will happen? I have no idea. I mean, this thing has capacitors on it. I mean power chokes it the board itself hasn't been on in a very long time but that still doesn't mean that there's not power inside of it somewhere or stored in one of these capacitors and stuff 
So um, this is an old Dell motherboard. It's a socket 775. It was what we used to put. It was the original motherboard that we did the 32-bit mo uh, 32-bit monster project build in it when I built a computer from like 2010 or whatever it was. Uh, this was the main motherboard that I used for that. But without further ado, let's put it in. Let's see. I'm not going to do it for no for no minute. Let's do it for because I don't know what will happen. Let's do it for uh, let's do it for 30 seconds. Timer on. Okay, where's the fire extinguisher at? Okay, I got the fire extinguisher. All right, here we go. In three, two, one. You know, for all the stuff that's in there, I'm, I'm surprised it didn't do more. Man, I'm actually kind of disappointed in it. Well. Anybody need a motherboard? Oh, look at the battery. The battery's like crispy looking. Well, I mean, I don't really see any actual damage. Like, that was actually kind of disappointing. Maybe I should have put it in there longer. Uh, I mean, it's too late now. I, I would need a fresh motherboard to do it again because this one's already been cooked. So whatever would happen would already happen. But, um, yeah. Woo. So, yeah, I know, right? Stinks. What you find was popped? I don't know what's popped. It still won't work. The light still won't come on. So, uh, but, yeah, there's that. And then... I really don't have anything else to throw in there. I've pretty much threw everything in there. So, Well, anyway, I guess that includes our video for today. I appreciate you guys watching. Make sure to leave me a like. Subscribe if you're new. What's that? The bulb? Is it LED? Fill it. Is it hot? Oh, wow. The microwave. Ooh, that is hot. That's the bulb out of there. That shouldn't get that hot. That's really hot. It was picking up the LED, the signal from the other bulb was telling me somebody's cooking my ass. <laughs> <laughs> I'm out of here. John, good seeing you. Good see Later, you. Pop. All right. All right, guys, we're out of here. Make sure to subscribe, leave a like, all that good stuff. See y'all next time.